doing today? Woo! I am having a good day. Even though it's 100 degrees out, now it's cooled down to 94. It is 7.50 in the evening. You wouldn't know it with the amount of sunlight we got. And it's going to stay sunny until about almost 9 o'clock. Or at least that's when the sunset will dip down enough where light might become an issue for flying. I have very, very ambitious flight goals ahead of us. We're going to zip up to the open space. I got my Blade Theory W race wing. Excuse me. FPV race wing. All dialed in and um, we got four fully charged 1300 milliamp. 4S, no 3S. <sighs> In the bad boy, ready to tear it up. And I haven't flown my wing nearly enough lately. So we're not going to really do any HD on it. We're, it's just going to be run Cam Swift analog, which is for analog video quite good. And um, we'll see how it goes. I also, that's not, see, that's not the ambitious part. That's no problem. We can go do that. I also brought my Vortex 150. Oh, run people over. I also brought my Vortex 150, and um, I have all the batteries uh, charged right now. I don't have that many batteries for it, but I have six or seven, I think. Yeah, and those are all charged up. So we got that, and then. Um, that stop sign comes out of nowhere. On top of that, I brought my Tiny Whoop, which our new frame came from Horizon Hobby. Great deal. They're only, you know, the regular frame's like $6.99. The Inductrix Pro frame is uh, $7.99. So it's like, you know, a dollar more. Um, And uh, it's a lot more durable and very easy to change out, uh, especially without that crappy canopy that you get with the regular inductors that also adds a lot of weight. Um, this one, it just has a uh, 3D printed camera mount already built in, really screwed in perfectly. It was able, I changed the entire thing out in minutes. Um, it took me like, seriously, like five, 10 minutes. And it was like I had a brand new whoop. Uh, really, <laughs> seriously, as soon as I, um, took off. I could see a big difference. And um, I did some little, I might have it on DVR. I did this one flight where I just did some insane acrobatics with my tiny whoop. I did, um, I don't even know, like a quadruple or triple roll and it pulled out of it perfectly and I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. Holy shit. The park's open. Let's do it. We're going to fly the wing instead of the open space. We're going to go back up in the neon. This is a perfect place to go fly some stuff. These fields are going to be nice and empty. At the very end, there's some open space. Yeah will be perfect for the wing to fly. Only like maybe one string of power lines to look out for. Ah! Just to fill you in, well, like, I'm sorry I'm slurping so much on the night. Cappuccino Blast from 31 Flavors. Made with Jamocha Almond Fudge Ice Cream, but it's really good. The other thing we got going on is uh, we got, um, so we got our Inductrix frames in, and then along with that, we also had ordered, um, props for the torrent and a new set of prop guards even though I don't know how much I'm going to be using those um, but the prop guards um, are blue and I ordered black and blue props so it should be pretty good Right here at the end. 
fly a few packs here. So, here I'll give you a visual of what I am looking at over here. So, yeah. See, we're just in this parking lot. We're kind of surrounded 360 degrees, and then right behind us is soccer fields. So, we actually have um, a really good spot here to, to do some really good flying. So, thanks for watching Puppet Master FUV. I hope you like um, my channel and what I'm trying to do, uh, promoting the RC and paying it forward with my son. I uh, love you guys in the comments you leave and just the community that I've found. This has been really a great form of therapy and meditation for me. So, anyways, happy Friday and keep flying.